Hello friends, welcome to my channel, myself Parag Jabulkar. In this video, we will see how to run tests parallelly in test engine framework. So see here, I have taken one example. We have my test package and in this package, we have three classes. Program 1.java, here there are two test cases. In program 2.java, there are two test cases. In program 3.java, again there are two test cases. We have one XML file and here in this suit, we have two tests. So see, two tests are two modules. This is one test. This is another test, right? So there are two test modules. And in our first test module, we have two classes. Now see, so when we run this code, so for example, see, when I'm running code like this, so see, we'll get the output. So see, here, this is first test, right? So this will run first and after that, this test will get run. Right, but if we want to run this test parallelly, so that also we can do in test ng. For that, just we have to do simple setting. Now see how to run this test parallelly in this test ng framework. So see, here we have tag suit. Now see, here we have to use one attribute parallel is equal to. Now see what we want to run parallelly test. Right, so in double quote we have to mention test. See. So what we want to run parallel test. Now see how many tests you want to run parallelly. So that you have to mention here. And for that purpose, you have to use thread dash count is equal to in double quote, you have to mention number. So see here two tests are there. So suppose I want to run this two tests parallelly. This is one test, first test, and this is second test, right? So I want to run this two tests parallelly. So I can mention like this. So attribute that is thread dash count is equal to here I have to mention number. So here two tests are there. Suppose I want to run uh, three tests parallelly, so I can mention three. Suppose I want to run uh, ten tests parallelly, so I can mention ten. So as per our need, we can mention the number. So in this way, we can run this test parallelly. See, if I run this code, so same output will get, but this test will run parallelly. So it will take less time to execute. Now see, so here we are running test parallelly, right? Suppose I want to run uh, these classes parallelly. So see, here I can mention. So see, in this test, there are two classes, right? I have mentioned two classes. Suppose I want to run them parallelly. So here I can mention parallel is equal to in double quote classes. And how many classes you want to run parallelly? So here I have to mention thread count thread dash count is equal to in double quote. So suppose I want to run two classes parallelly. So I can mention like this. Now see, we'll run our code. So see, we'll get the same output, but we are running these classes and the test parallelly so that it will take less time. So see what we have done in this suit, there are two tests, right? First test, second test. So to run them parallelly, here we have mentioned attribute parallel is equal to test. Why test? Because I want to run this test parallelly. How many tests I want to run parallel? So here I have to mention their count number. If in this test I want to run classes parallelly, so here I have to mention parallel is equal to classes. What is the meaning of this? I want to run these classes parallelly. And how many classes I want to run parallel? So here I have to mention count. So in this way, we can run test parallelly in test engine framework. So friends, I hope you like this video. If it is, then click on like, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video. So stay connected. Thank you.